It took almost three years to be completed. From the time the project was conceived to the time the finishing touches were being applied. The big boss of the project admitted that realizing the vision did not come without challenges. The challenge is that you design, you design and build at the same time is a challenge um, to keep everybody motivated uh, to deliver every day. It's a seven day, uh, 24 hours, you know, seven, 24 hours. It's, you're working flat out. The whole teams have been a good support for us. Medan is an Arabic word which means meeting place, a fitting name for the new venue. Unlike the tracks in Nadal Shiba where the Dubai races were held for 14 years, Medan's racetrack is connected to a five-star hotel and surrounded by other developments such as residential and commercial areas. The team behind Medan points out several reasons for guests to rave about the races. Well, I think the, what's new with the carnival courses, the different courses, the, the, the turf course and the all-weather. That surface, you know, it's a new surface, uh, uh, a synthetic surface. So that'll be some of the changes, and we're looking just on a few minor changes of the program itself that will come. You know, that'll come out very shortly. That one had a track that is uh, uh, sometimes a little bit challenged to bring the spectators closer to the action. Here, the action is really comes to the spectators, plus the convenience, and it has a, a, a hotel that has uh, rooms, uh, uh, racetrack side, which. Uh, for people who elect to uh, privately watch uh, their, uh, their, their races and the activities. And finally, on race day, the 60,000-seater grandstand was full and the races were successful as in the past 14 years.